good afternoon everyone i am vicky designs my name is my full name is akongwe fishakwe victoria and i'm the creative director of vicky designs so today i'll be teaching you how to make two types of air bonnet that's the air bonnet with the band you can see it is lovely with name you can see the inner parts neatly folded you can see everything is neatly folded everything is neat and the name is fine you'll be learning how to make the band fix the band on it they will be making learning how to this is an incomplete air bonnet so i'll be learning how to make this to the same type of air bonnet so this is the two types of air bonnets we'll be learning how to make today and i hope you enjoy your video and if you don't understand anything you can just ask questions and i'll be there to answer your questions and you can share some things with us that you know and i hope you enjoy the class feel free gonna enjoy you guys i feel like i need to do so i'm gonna go shake so so guys i mentioned 23 this is folded by two so folded by two it should be it should be to be 11 and a half it will be 11 and a half so i mentioned i put it into two so when i put it into two i'll still fold it again into another two so i'll fold it into since i folded it into two this make sure it, this is 11 and a half making two of almost two of char and the same thing will be here Wow, it's really looking like this. So, we're going to perform magic now. You can see what's gonna go on here. So, I'm going to cut an elastic casing of one inch. Then, you can see that I've rolled it one inch. Then, this is the band that I'm going to use at the front. You can see the band. This is the band I'll use at the front of the air bonnet. Then, let's cut. So I'm going to fix it like this on top of the lining. You can see lining down, and I'll fix, place it on top of the lining, the one inch lining I cut. Then I'm going to pleat it. If you want the pleating to be big, some people they like it big, some people they like it small. Then that's what you be doing. Either you want big or small pleating. And you're going to pleat. Can sit. I'm going to take another inches in pleats. Close, you can see it's ready for me. You can see that it's ready for me. You can see it's ready for me when we pleated it. And hold it ready for all of it almost. 
I'm only knitting it. So I'm going to turn it inside like this. Take it like this. Then turn it inside. Then fold it in like this. And that's how I'll do it. Then I'll sew it around. You can see how I knit it. You can see the edges, they are not showing that it is. You see how neat the edges is. Then I'm going to take the band. I measured 20 inches of the band. This is 20 inches of the band. Then I'll take it like this. Right side facing right side. I know when I sew it, I know complete the edge. Then I'll take right side facing right side. Then I'll stitch it by half inches. Right side facing right side. Now you can see it's easy band thing. Fix it like this. And for the stitch it. Then I'm going to fix it. As I already mark it, this will be the upper part. This will be I already this piece face here. And I'm going to join it right side facing right side. Remember? Then I'm going to join it round. You see now I wrote it right side facing right side. Then I'll join it round.